earlier you get diagnosed, the better. I've had it nine years. Don't, do not read everything on the internet. Use our website, get on our message board, here's our Facebook group, get on that, ask questions. They've got all these little solutions and it's a work in progress. It's not doom and gloom. Join the PH Association. That's the first thing. So you can talk to other people. My advice is just to arrange your life around your house and friends. You have to realise that you're just living with a disease and it's just a matter of looking after each other and doing the right thing by each other, as hard as it, hard as it is. You just need to make a new normal, but still be able to do everything. Yeah. yeah. I think you take an approach where you want to do everything, you want to give everything a go now, kind yeah. of thing. And knowing that there is medication, there shouldn't be a worry yet, because I'm not progressing, like I'm severe preliminary hypertension, but I'm stable. You can survive this. When we come together, we can be a pretty strong team. It's something that we can all draw from. Think and uh, just pick yourself back up. Let's go, we can do it. Like, there is a positive side to it yeah. <laughs> that I can see now, like in other patients. It's a very individualised disease. It's important to not compare yourself to everybody else because everybody's body is so different. For, and also for the primary carers to um, also just look after yourself, it's so important. But just try and get a little bit of time away for yourself as well to keep your strength up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's not normal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it still has challenges. PH is like a new normal and then Transplants like a whole different normal. <laughs> right. Another new normal. <laughs>lots of medication, there's really good um, cardiologists out there. There's so much um, research going into it. My partner says you'll probably outlive me, you'll be an old lady. <laughs>